What's going on over there? Getting ready. Getting ready for what? For a little cute home. <laughs> Yo, welcome back to our channel. Today, <laughs> we're gonna show you how to change a duvet cover in a second. What? <laughs> you look like a ghost. <laughs> Do they cover over you? Over me, but reversed. That's the key. This is real mulberry silk. Whoa. $500. This is not $500. Yeah. This was $500? Yeah. No, I think it was like $200. Like $200? <laughs> I think it was like $100. Wait, are you actually yeah, serious? No, I don't. Is this $500? This? Yeah, we paid it $20. Bucks. Oh, this is $20. Bucks. But for our fans, it's $500. Oh, of course, the fans. <laughs> Alright, guys, I'm doing. Um, we've got these, Robbie did these shelves yesterday, which I'm obsessed with, and so I found this at Target, it's very cute, it's not much, but I'm just going to start adding like little decorations here over the course of, you know, it'll probably take some time, but I got this Dr. Teal's salt, and I'm going to put it in with my, my jar here, so let's do that. Good start, so I'll keep going here and keep y'all updated on how it turns out. We are going to Elevation Worship tonight. We're so excited. I'm waiting for Robbie. Robbie went to go pick up a vacuum. He'll be back in a second. We really needed a new vacuum for the house, and he is such a certain hurt, so he went to go do that for us. Let me show you guys what we are eating for dinner. Just made something really quick, nothing special. This is like a creamy basil sauce. Have this pasta that we cooked from lunch and then already cooked tilapia. Amazing. What do you think it is? Yeah, what is the sauce? It's not pesto. It's a heavy whipping cream, pesto, chicken broth, and cornstarch. Ma che sta roba? Ma this is not pasta. You don't do pasta with heavy cream and. And what was that? Cornstarch. It tastes good, no? Yeah, it's fabulous. <laughs> it's what? It's fabulous. <laughs> we made it! To the concert! Robbie's rocking the King is Coming shirt. What is the fit selection tonight? Some nice jeans that shrunk in the wash. <laughs> and he's looking very handsome. <laughs> Dang, girl. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna take this hat. I feel like all the videos of me are gonna be really funny because you're taking them. Elevation. Now we're just doing our daily lives, so thought we would just show you guys what we do on a what is today? I think today's Wednesday. What we do on a Wednesday. So I'm a wedding florist, so I work on the weekends a lot. So usually Wednesdays, Tuesdays are pretty chill for me, doing lots of admin stuff and all that. Robbie works for an apartment ministry, so he works nine to five. So he's working right now. But let me show you guys what I'm working on. I thought it would be cute to do like a little date jar. So I'm like writing down different dates. Um, this one says book an Austin Airbnb experience. Another one is let's see, fondue night with the movie, go bowling, and just like restful for me to do crafts. So I try to rest on these these days. No, look at my hair, I need something. <laughs> Come on, this just is going choose a date. date. This is going on. What date we get for our first date? Are you ready? Yeah. Come on. Choose a good one for us. And you have to read it out too. Ah! 
What does it say? Oh, there's two. No, it's the same thing. Oh, it's the same thing. What does it say? It says, go to every gym in the city and hit legs. <laughs> I don't think I wrote that one on there. Visit Zilker Botanical Gardens. Get a snack at the food trucks. Right, if you think my idea was better, put a thumbs up. <laughs> if you think Brianna's idea was better, leave a comment below. We are picking up after the last video of when I when you chose the date card, but unfortunately it's a 60 degrees in Austin, which is rare. So we will not be going to the botanical gardens. Are you sad? <laughs> He's not very sad. I don't think he was pumped for that one. <laughs> so instead, we're gonna go eat uh, lunch right now, and then we're gonna go to the library. Awesome. Yes. <laughs> We just went to church. Do you want to tell everyone about the prophetic word? No, we just want to be really honest. We pulled up the camera because we literally, Bri and I, we've been praying about, hey Lord, like how can we have positive impact using, you know? YouTube. YouTube. We're praying about it. And this praying lady Praying about just, starting a YouTube channel. Yeah, just praying about, yeah, using social media yeah. maybe in general. And then this sweet sister and bro brother and sister come up and just pray over us. And she just says, I hear social media. Still kind of like super thrown off by it. And Bray's like, let me just pull out <laughs> the camera and start, right? So, I mean, it's, it's amazing. So this is just raw. Like yeah. this is us. It's raw, raw footage. Like, you know, when... when why did we start? We want to look back to this video and be like, wow, like we've been praying, the Lord answered, and now here we are. We're excited. We don't yeah. know what we're doing. Love you guys. We're thankful for you guys. And we're excited to bring you along the journey as we try YouTube for the Lord. Woohoo! For the Lord. Hey, we're at the library. That was so good. I know this. Love you guys and we'll see you in our next video.